This is Saj Mohammed. I film Bolton. <laughs> <laughs> Today I'm inter- interviewing Haroon Khan. Um, we are Amir Khan's Glove Community Centre. Um, hi Haroon, how are you doing? Hi, how are you? Not well, seen you for a while, Saj. I've not seen you. <laughs> Where have you been? It's been here and there, training gym. Not like some. Yeah, Haroon just come back from a three week holiday in Vegas. Or was it Marbella? Or was it Tenerife? Magaluf. You, you're talking about Magaluf, Magaluf on. It's Magaluf. Oh, Magaluf. <laughs> Sorry. No, you know, I just been gym and gym, gym, gym. That's why. That's why I never see you. Yeah. So anyway, um, Harry. I like to call him Harry. I don't like to call him Haroon. Haroon sounds too professional, so I like to call him Harry. Um, you've not fought for a while. When is the next fight? I mean, you went to America. You you shocked the fans there with a crazy first round knockout. Um, you know, you're under a lot of pressure. It was only your second fight of your career. And you've come. You you went there with a bang. And when we when we looking to see you out next? Well, after the second fight, I was uh, at the Ami's wedding to do. The, went through the wedding, then um, had Ramadan. So I've just been off for a bit. But now I'm back in gym. Straight after Ramadan, I was back in gym. And day by day, I'm just in gym. I'm just gonna be gonna speak to Eddie. See what Eddie Eddie's got lined up for us. And if 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 Eddie's got if Eddie's happy to put me on his shores, I'm I'm more than happy to fight on his shores. I'm sure Eddie will. What what he Coogan? I'm sure Coogan will rub him up a bit on the way home. <laughs> oh uh, yeah, I think that's the. I just want to stay active. I've had two two and all with one knockout, and I think no one's seen the best of me yet. And there's more to come. Uh, the first fight that I had in Sheffield, that was my first fight after 18 months out of the ring. So I was a bit rusty. Then the second one, I showed what I'm capable of, and the Americans loved me there. So, but where, whenever there's a date there available, I'm, I'm gonna take it with both hands. Oh, that's good. Um, obviously, I'm helping to manage you as well, so I can answer that question as well. But we want to get Harry out there as, as much as possible now, um, at least once or twice every couple of months, and hopefully at the end of the year on December seventh, which is your brother's next day, I believe. Um, any news on that? He's in camp at the moment. Uh, so far, we're looking at Alexander. Um, I've been speaking to him, and he's confident. He's training well. He's got his padman from New York flown over, and I've been hearing a lot of good stuff that he's in shape already. And I think it was good that Tony came over, the strength conditioning thing, then and worked a bit for two, three weeks with him and got him in shape. So you would be looking to be on the undercard of that as well? Yeah, definitely. I just want to um, be active. Like I said, I want one before December. And then hopefully in 2014, just get as many as I can. Harry, um, I believe you've done a bit of modelling in the past for Selfridges. And you're a good-looking lad. You've got quite a few Twitter followers as well. <laughs> what I don't understand is I'm a normal person and I get a lot of attention from girls. But how how do you handle it? You must get loads of, plenty of attention. I mean, 100 times more than I do. How do, how do you deal with it? Or just, just, you know, if you're single, just say it. But... If you're taken, just let them know how many girlfriends you've got. <laughs> no, I'm single, and I think that's the best thing that that that's happened. Being single, girls are headache, and um, you know that, <laughs> why? Why are girls headache? Girls Tell me headache. that now. <laughs> why are girls headache? <laughs> no, this is headache. You know, girls is a big distraction in boxing. Women or girls? Oh, both. Fe- females. But women are more females. mature. Girls are girls. They're gonna make. They're gonna give you headache. But women are more mature. They like to take the headache. No, but at the end of the day, I'm focusing on, on my boxing career. So, um, so boxing comes first. Then once I've, once I've, I'm happy where I am in boxing. That's when I start looking. So, what? How? How old? How old are you right now? Twenty-two. How I many got married when he was twenty-six? So when are you looking to get married? I still say to myself, I'm still a baby. Twenty-two. That that makes me happy saying I'm a baby. But yeah, I think so far I'm concentrating on boxing. Uh, I asked you a question. When are you looking to get married? <laughs> Mm, that's not in my mind yeah I'm going to just let my family look yeah, after that married to boxing Harun Karl's married to boxing <laughs> so girls stay away from him um, stay away from me as well because Harry just told me you're a <laughs> headache um, what else I mean you're here now at the Gallagher's gym there's a big media workout here Joe Gallagher's doing really well I mean he's turned our Amir Khan's Glove Community Centre into Gallagher's gym he's taken the name away but you know we respect that he's doing a brilliant job um, what do you think about how he's doing and the fighters that he's got you know Joe's got a Great camp. He's got um, British champions. He's got. He's hopefully he'll have a. He's he's, world champion now. Yeah, well, he's got his first world champion. But um, Scott Craig, he can go all the way. I'm sure he can go over to America and conquer America as well. I've seen. I've seen him since amateurs. Even the amateur gym has been in Berry, and you know from there, I knew he was tough. And you've got 
like the likes of Scott Craig, you've got uh, the Smith brothers, like three British champions and one English champion. They made history there. You've got Crawler, who's he's he's, he's got his bright his features are bright still. Who do you think's the best out of all of them? No, oh, that you know you're causing a war. No, <laughs> it's all right. I, I, um, Scott Craig, I've always been uh, since he, since I seen him in the amateurs. So you don't like Crawler then? <laughs> no, no Crawler knows I like him. Okay, what about the Smith brothers uh, from all four? Who's the best one? No, they're all amazing. Um, Callum's uh, records says it uh, says a lot. Eight and all with six straight knockouts, the last six fights, and Callum. All three of them, they, they're all great. Um, I can see Callum going a lot far and um, becoming a world champion before you know it. He's strong. Who pisses you off the most from the, all the Gallagher fighters? And including uh, Joe, who pisses you off the most? Is that including you as well? Not including me. I'm not <laughs> part of that camp. But I, no, I, you know, no, they're all they're all cool. Um, every time I see them, they're all letting on, and I like them. They treat me like I'm part of the team. Uh-huh. That's good. So, what, um, you're at Oliver's gym at the moment. Uh, how are things over there? I can't. They can't get any better. To finish my session today. I, I, this week's been so tough. Uh, but yeah, I'm enjoying every bit of it and just waiting for a date to be given to me, and so I can look forward to that. Right. Another question: Why do you not follow anybody on Instagram? I mean, I, I never liked Instagram. Um, I never thought I'd get on it, but now I'm on it. Um, I'm just wondering, Harry, you've got probably what, just under ten thousand followers. How come you don't follow anybody on Instagram? I want to be different. That's why. Want to be different? One, one, one in a, yeah, that's his answer. One in, a, one in a million, I am. All right. Okay, Harry. Nice speaking to you. Um, I film Bolton. That was. I will see you soon. Cheers. Thanks.